What if your Galaxy phone is secretly next in line for the biggest software upgrade of the year, and you don't even know it yet? Samsung's rolling out One UI 8, and the beta wave is about to hit hard. But which devices are first, and are older models really being left behind? Let's break it all down because the rumors just turned into real movement. Welcome back viewers, Sam here. Don't forget to like the video, share it with your tech squad, and smash that subscribe button for more updates just like this. After months of waiting, One UI 8 is finally making serious progress for the Galaxy S24 series. A brand new firmware was just spotted on Samsung servers, confirming that internal testing has officially begun for the S24 Ultra's international variant. Until now, One UI 8 based on Android 16 was only visible for upcoming devices like the S25 series and foldables. But this latest sighting flips the script, S24 users, you're back in the game. Now here's where things really heat up. Leaks suggest that the beta version of One UI 8 could be landing for the S24 Z Fold 6 and Z Flip 6 as early as the last week of June. If that's true, Samsung is speeding up the rollout way faster than anyone expected. But there's a twist the Galaxy S23 lineup. Yes, last year's flagship is rumored to join the beta train by the end of the same month. Fold 5 and Flip 5 they're tagging along too. By early July, Here's the exciting news, you can now reserve Samsung's upcoming Galaxy devices and unlock amazing benefits without making any payment up front. Just click the special link in the description, which takes you straight to the official Samsung reservation page. There, you'll also get an exclusive sneak peek at their unpacked teaser trailer. Once you're on the site, simply scroll down and enter your first name, last name, and email address. You can also add your phone number if you like. Make sure to check the giveaway box and answer two quick questions. Once the Reserve Now button turns blue, tap it, and you're all set. By reserving early, you'll automatically get a chance to win 5,000 hours in Samsung credit, receive a 50,000 Samsung credit, and unlock savings of up to 150 on your next Galaxy device. No strings attached, just free perks for showing interest early. Samsung may shift focus to the 2022 those bringing the S22 Fold 4 and Flip 4 into the fold. That's a wide net. But don't pop the champagne just yet. While internal testing is promising, the beta rollout will be phased. South Korea, Germany, and the US usually get first dibs. If you're outside those zones, you may be in for a longer wait. Also, big heads up, Samsung hasn't officially confirmed the full rollout roadmap. Everything we know so far comes from insider leaks and server info. That means timelines could shift and supported models might change depending on final testing. Now, here's something not many are talking about. One UI 8 may not feel revolutionary on the surface but it sneaks in some slick upgrades, especially if you're a gamer. Game Booster now on version 7.0, 51.103 brings two standout features. First, it can automatically pre-download additional game files while your phone is idle charging, and on Wii Fi, that means no more annoying delays the first time you launch a new game. Second, the startup animation of games will now sync perfectly with the actual loading time. No more waiting through a long intro just to hit another load screen. It sounds small, but together these updates make gaming feel so much smoother, and that's just one corner of the update. One UI 8 is also likely to inherit some heavy-duty Android 16 security tools, including advanced protection mode. Think theft protection, auto-reboot after long inactivity, and memory shielding to keep shady apps at bay. You'll even get smarter app scanning, spam call blocking, and the option to shut down sketchy 2G networks altogether. For hearing aid users, Android 16 brings clearer calls by reducing background noise, and Samsung's likely to include this too. Tablets will also get big usability boosts like desktop-style window resizing and taskbar overflow. These features might not grab headlines, but they make everyday use way better. And let's not forget Material U3. The design now feels tighter and more responsive, with group notifications, dynamic refresh rates, and sharper animations that finally feel as premium as the hardware they run on. So what's the bottom line? If you own a Galaxy S24, S23, or even the S22 series, you're probably not going to be stuck waiting months. The beta is expanding fast. And while Samsung hasn't dropped an official calendar yet, the signs are everywhere. From firmware sightings to internal build numbers, the engine is running, and it's only a matter of time before beta invites start dropping. Whether you're hyped for faster gaming, stronger security, or just cleaner visuals, One UI 8 is shaping up to be more than just another update. It's the beginning of Samsung's next chapter with Android 16 at the core. Keep your eyes on your notifications. The beta wave might hit your device when you least expect it.